What's up, guys? This is Los and Anthony with the Malco Cast. I hope you guys are having a great day. Anthony and I are having a wonderful day, as always. <laughs> Trying to. <laughs> Trying to have a wonderful day. Guys, today we're excited. Today we are excited, and that's because <laughs> we are going to be talking about one of the best shows out there, Stranger Things, guys. Stranger Things. Yes, that's right. Today we are reacting to part two or i guess it's called volume two of season four anthony corrected me earlier i thought it was starting on june 30th but it in fact it is starting on july the first well dude what did you think of the first half before oh, we watched dude, the, the first half i loved it i loved it and i think what made me love it so much was the introduction of like the the new characters especially that metalhead character yeah, yeah, I forget his name, but um, they is it, is know, it Eddie? Uh, yeah, Eddie. Was that his name, Eddie? I think so. Okay, yeah, but but anyways, I thought he added a lot to the whole thing, and then like how there was a little bit of separation between um the main character, one of the main characters, I, I forget his name, but he went over to the jock side kinda, and then oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then like he was torn. Uh, and then, but he finally sided with the, with his nerd friends and stuff. And I yeah. thought I thought that was kind of cool. And what did you think of it? I thought it was good, dude. Uh, I will be honest. There for me, there was a uh, times it drug on a little bit, where it got it got boring to me a, co a few times. But overall, I enjoyed it. You know, like I'm looking forward to this next. Uh, this next chapter of it, you know, uh, is this the final? Is this it? I think like, is, are they done it? You know, like after this, I'd never say never. And especially when it's making money, like they are hand over right? fist, you know, um, what did have, have their own experiences the beginning? <laughs> they had their own circus. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. And you went to the uh, Stranger Things experience. This is an exclusive experience. It's happening in only three paces places did we buy tickets for that to be honest with you we bought tickets for that uh a year and a half ago or something like that damn but because of covid yeah. because of covid obviously you know like so yeah, yeah so, this was the, the makeup date for it so we're going to talk about that too we're going to talk about your experience and that's open only happening in like san francisco new york and london from what i from what i know so Oh wow, really? That, it's crazy. We're gonna get into that, but but right now, what we're gonna do is we're going to react. Uh, first, I want to know though: Have you been watching Stranger Things from the very uh, first season? Yes, I have. I've watched them all. Actually, when uh, me and my lady Nikki first started seeing each other, Stranger Things was the first thing that we did together. Uh -huh. You know, it was like that was our first. Uh, yeah, we started. We, we started yeah, watching this together show. and <laughs> so, Your yeah. first couple. True shows. story. <laughs> All right, so oh let's check out this. Uh, this uh, is a Stranger Things for Volume Two trailer. Let's check this out. I know you're frightened. You're terribly frightened by what you've seen. But I'm not going to lie to you. Your friends are not prepared for this fight. Hawkins will fall. <laughs> My friends need me. You're not ready. That's what you think. That's what you think, buddy. Elle's gonna fuck some shit up, dude. You're ready. Not, <laughs> stop. not until he's taken. You guys die, though. But I have this terrible feeling. It might not work out for us this time. I like them all. I like them all too. He's over. I like Uma Thurman. Uma Thurman's daughter. Oh, 
all the season finale. Damn, he's playing guitar. He's shredding guitar. Sick. Oh, yeah. Sick. Your friend is dead. Yeah. Your friends have lost. Cover running up the hill, dude. Running up the hill. What is that? Yeah, that's that's the famous song. That's the song that uh, everyone's been talking about. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. Who does it? Oh, forget her name. I forget her name. Is it Kate? Kate? Kate Bush? Let me look here. You put me on the spot. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Yeah, Running Up the Hill. It's an 80s song. I never heard it before. Yeah, Kate Bush. That's right, Kate Bush. Well, so, what did you think? What do you think, dude? Dude, I you thought... excited? Oh, hell yeah. It's, this one is going to be a banger. It's going to be dope. I, I can already tell there are parts of, like, I'm going to love in this, Who in dies? this trailer. Who dies? Who dies? That's right. Somebody's dying. I think it's going to be... Who dies, dude? Who do you think dies? Eddie, the metalhead. He's always a casualty, man. Metal is always nah, a casualty. Dude. Metal never dies, dude. Eddie's gonna survive. <laughs> um, I think, ah, oh, dude. I think uh, L's boyfriend's gotta die, dude. Will? Yeah. Is that no? Is that his name, Will? No. Yeah, Will. Yeah. I can't think. Is I think Will? it is Will. I think you're right. Or Mikey. Will or Mikey. Or who's Will? Or was Will the first? What's the name of the first kid that got kidnapped? Will. I think that's that's Will. Okay. Who's the other dude? The tall, beetle looking, <laughs> the, the pumpkin Ramones, headed freak. The Ramones looking dude? Yeah. <laughs> okay. So let me look here. Uh, so there's the tall dude is Mike. Okay. Of course, Eleven. Will is a dude that got missing. Uh, Lucas is the one who joined the Jocks. Dustin, of course, is a fan favorite. I love Dustin. Max is the redhead girl. Hopper. Steve is one of my favorites. Nancy. Nancy needs to get with Steve. I think. Um, Nancy reminds me of a ch dude. The way they did her makeup is perfect for like eighties. <laughs> like she looked like every girl in the eighties, dude. Like it, the hair, the yeah. every way she dressed, dude. Is like, yeah, yeah. One of the things that I love about this whole series is series is that the eighties music. It's like it's on point, man. It's like really accurate. I really love and dig all the music, and I think it's kind of it's kind of crazy how like Kate Bush has now found, uh, you know, uh, herself back in the spotlight after Stranger Things aired her song. And her song specifically was the one that um, what's the character's name? It's the redhead, the redhead gal, uh, Max. She uh -huh. used Kate Bush's song to escape the demon, because the demon, of course, controls everyone. But she used that song to block his control, and I thought that that was, I thought that's pretty cool that they're giving like these '80s songs a little bit of life back into them. Or is it said how, how terrible that song was? It even scared the monsters away. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> like, ah, I think we're talking about on. back of the local bands. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> Malcontent would save me from the the devil. Specifically. <laughs> no, dude, I can't wait for it. Uh, the Stranger Things. Uh, yeah. I, I, it's the season finale, though, dude. Uh, so you guys don't... Where, where can they go with this from, the, you know, from... Uh, I don't know, man. It's, well, that means it's got to keep going, dude, right? You yeah, know? That's, that's a good question because you guys took it to the next level when you guys went to the Stranger Things experience in San Francisco. And I saw the photos and we're going to... Let's, let's, let's check out the photos that you guys took at this Stranger Things <laughs> experience. And this was kind of cool. I saw it, and I can tell you, dude, that I was just like, damn, that looks like a lot of fun. Yeah, it was pretty awesome, dude. Uh, before we started filming, I was telling you off air that uh, it kind of, the, the only thing that's – it was a little short. Um, 
it was worth the price of admission, I suppose. Like, I think it was 50 bucks, you know? Yeah. Uh, <laughs> fucking. So, so the photo that you're seeing right now is a picture of you and your fam <laughs> posing. And is that the Demogorgon? Yeah, dude. Uh, coming out of the, uh, what do they call that? With the open spot. Yeah. Where... That's where Hopper disappeared. So. Yeah, dude, that is actually at the end of uh, at the end of the experience because the experience you go into rooms and stuff, and you know they have people who are actors, paid actors, and uh, you know they're acting out all this stuff, and you're participating in it. You know, like we had to try to crush a can with our hands, you know, like but with our mind, you know, and like oh yeah, and so you become a part of the experience, you know, and. Um, Oh, yeah. It was it was really neat, dude. Like watching them all in, in character and uh, that's so awesome. acting in front of you. But the only crappy thing, and I get why they do it, dude. Like you couldn't take pictures inside. <laughs> well, because they, you got to pay for that, you know. Like, <laughs> oh, you, can just, you can just cop it to the uh, to the demon mind controlling you, dude. <laughs> so. But once you come out of the experience, dude, th that picture that we, those there are uh, in kind of like the lobby, like you walk in and they have like the roller rink, uh, the pizza bus, the uh, photo booth, they have like the stores, they have everything like you see in the uh, movie, you know, or on the show. On the show, yeah. So hey, And dude. all the people... All the people there, like the staff, they're all in character, dude. We actually walked up and ordered a pizza, and we surprised the guy, and he actually broke character. <laughs> he, he's like, he says something. He's like, oh, shit, my bad. He's like, I broke character. <laughs> and we started laughing, dude. Like, we're like, it's all good, dude. <laughs> you can't hate on that. Hey, dude, is Q taller than you? No, he's standing on his tippy toes, man. Oh, yeah. <laughs> he's trying to put his head in his big ass head in that big ass hand. You see that? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I see that. I see that. Okay, so, okay, okay. Who else is in that photo? There's Nikki. There's Ethan. Uh, Ethan. Ethan, and then uh, my girl Nikki and uh, the Demogorgon. His name's John. We got to give a shout out to them, the familia. <laughs> yeah, it was a. Uh, I would recommend it to anybody who wants to go and check it out, dude. It's a good family experience, man. Oh, so. dude, you guys are playing a pinball machine, dude. Yeah, dude, they had a pinball machine. <laughs> dude. Sick. I didn't know they made one. It's pretty Yeah, dope. dude, uh, it, it was pretty cool. You go into the bar. There's a bar area, and they actually have some of the uh, – remember, the like, from the first season, dude, the first chick who got killed? Yeah. The bigger girl? They had her outfit <laughs> yeah. in, in a case there and shit, you know, and they had, uh, what's the kid with no teeth? Uh, Dustin. Dustin. Dustin, yeah. Yeah, they had, like, his hat up in there and his earpiece thing that he wears, you know, oh, like. Oh, like a nerd piece. <laughs> yeah, dude, like, so, yeah, they had this phone booth. If you actually pick up the handle, dude, it, uh, it had a dial tone. <laughs> oh, yeah, oh, no shit. Yeah, dude, so. they have one at Cheers also. I know. From from what I heard, it still works. I don't know if that's true. I don't know if it is. Dude. Comment the subscriptions or in the uh, yeah. Yes. We want to know, Maddie. So. Maddie's got to got to give us a scoop on that. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> Nikki in the Hellfire Club. I saw that sticker. Check that out. So, <laughs> yeah, can you dude. buy those stickers there? Yeah, you, you can buy pretty much everything there, dude. Oh, that's so dope. Yeah, it was pretty fun, man. It was a, like I said, it was a good family experience. And so is this a, a photo? Good... Can you buy all this? Well, what is this Rank of Mania? What is that? That's where uh, L got beat or beat up that girl at. Yeah, yeah. But can you buy, st can you go skating there actually or no? No, 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 dude. It's just like little uh, cut or not cutouts, but it's like just part of the set, you know? Oh, okay. Okay. Can you buy any? Like they had a. Uh, the living room from uh, one of the houses. See, like all that? That's from the living room in, uh, I think, Winona Ryder's house. In that oh, oh, show. oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, there are the eight tracks here. Yeah, dude. 
So like we we took a picture sitting on the couch, you know, like. Oh, so this is supposed to be um, Will's mom's house then. Yeah, I think so. Rummy, Yahtzee, Hungry Hungry Hippo. No, they have Hungry Hungry Hippo there. I don't see that. Oh, so you were sitting oh, on the couch, just, dude, like. Yeah. So it's like a set <laughs> almost, huh? It's like a movie yeah, set. Yeah, dude. So the, like throughout the whole thing, that's how it was, dude. Like there's parts of the set everywhere, dude. Like afterwards, you know. Oh, yeah. There's a boom box there too. That's dope. <laughs> yeah, dude. They had eight track in there. <laughs> like, guys, oh, crap. Yeah, malcontent. And if you guys don't know about malcontent, you got I mean, that's why we're doing this podcast because of malcontent. You guys need to check out their their uh their Spotify and their Facebook page. Malcontent is the band that Anthony's in. Anthony needs to get some tape so he could have put one in, <laughs> in that boom box. <laughs> eight track. <laughs> We're upgrading, dude. We're going to A Track, man. Scoops. Can you get ice? Can you actually get ice cream at the scoop? Yeah, dude. You can get like they, you. Can, they had it set up. You can get ice cream. Like we got pizza. I think you'll see that there's the uh, the bus, the pizza bus thing. I think that's sick. Oh, Mind the original Flayer. drawing. Mind Flayer. Ooh. That's Remember, I think that was Will that drew that. Yeah, season two, episode four. That's sick. That's a piece of movie history right there, dude. The more movie walkie talkie. Yeah, see all the walkie talkie dude. <laughs> yeah, Evan goggles. Man. Any fan of Stranger Things would have been in heaven. Oh dude. At this. dude it was great. There was people, you know, dressed up like people were all dressed up in eighties the attire there, you know, like so there's the pizza bus. <laughs> I mean, that's what I would have done. That's my bag. So oh 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 so this is the 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 pizza bus that the that the that the stoner be driving huh Yeah 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 <laughs> The guy like Yeah dude, it was, it was great man the pizza was good too <laughs> Oh that's dope yeah, It was fun man it was a good time Oh a little demogorgon Yeah <laughs> Is that a puppet I I hope you got the next picture <laughs> Oh my god. I was doing, you know, terrible things to the Demogorgon. That's an X-rated uh, pick. Uh, we will just move on from that one. <laughs> uh, Ego. Oh, Lego they have all... Juju will go to one of the stores. They had a store. That, they had the fake Ego waffles that, you know, L loves. Oh, oh. <laughs> you know, on a side note, my my little ones here love the Ego waffles with Nutella. I don't know. Oh, why. that's probably so hella good, dude. It's the strangest thing, dude. Stranger Things. Stranger Things, exactly. Ah, oh, I love this photo. This is my favorite photo of them all, dude. Because if you guys don't know about Q, he's going to be an epic guitarist as well. He is already following in his dad's footsteps. And they're, they are carrying on that tradition, man. Right. That metal tradition in the familia, man. <laughs> The Hellfire Club. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, it's tight, dude. It's dope. That's cool. That's my favorite photo, I think. But uh, although Mostly. I have to say though that they made they made Eddie a little bit more ripped than uh, he, I know, he, dude. He <laughs> <is>. <laughs> I was cracking up too off that. I was like, oh, damn, they made steroids. <laughs> yeah, man. That's the that's the whole Kogan. Oh, like the family video, Ghostbusters. Oh, you can buy all. Can you buy all that candy or no? It's probably part of the prop, Tom. Huh? I think you could. I think you could. That's sick. Oh man, I miss video stores. That was like a whole. I do too, there. dude. I do too. Video stores were, dude. It was crazy though when you were there because, uh, like, even like if me and Nikki and the kids were just standing there talking, people would come up and just start talking to you who were like acting. Hey, could you vote for us or vote for me for a senior prom queen? You know, like, and oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, dude. Did, did, and, did, you, did you feel like saying, ah, oh, no, nah, shut up. Or like, <laughs> well, no, cause the one, one chick walked up and she said something. She's like, who here goes to whatever high school? And I was like, I pointed at the kids. I was like, they do. <laughs> <laughs> So, <laughs> that's funny. Then yeah, dude, it was too. it was cool, man. It was a it was a good experience. So it was overall, a, overall. How much what? How much was this? How much was it to enter? Do you recall? 
What's that? How much was it to be, uh, you know, to join? Because I want to go now. Oh, uh, we paid 50 bucks a ticket. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's, that's a little a little pricey, but I mean, I guess it's a one of a kind experience. Yeah, right? dude. Like I said, for, when you go, you'll understand, dude, because of the production, the amount of production they put into it, you know? Like, they even had hall, like, before you got, or when you first got there, if you had to go to the bathroom, they gave you a hall pass to go to the bathroom, dude. <laughs> like, so whereabouts yeah. in the city is it located, dude? In the Mission District. Oh, okay, so you can go get it. <laughs> right there. <laughs> Mission Burrito. What were you guys doing in that photo? <laughs> Uh, we were, I, I don't know. <laughs> we were just having fun. <laughs> that's cool, man. That's cool. Is that the building of the stranger? Yeah, that's where it was at right there. Oh, cool. The armory, I think. Historic. All right. All right. Well, well, yeah, man. I mean, it sounds, it sounds like you guys had a blast and, you know, it, you make me want to go. <laughs> and I, that's definitely one of the things that I'm going to put on our summer to-do list. Uh, definitely yeah, something that's like it's it's you know it's a good time to sp time with the family you know quality time i guess you know i think that we're missing that in this society where you know the kids are on their phones and on their xboxes and and they're watching tv but this is something that the, you can actually do to get the right. fam together you know right exactly dude and uh like i said we bought the tickets a year and a half ago so you know it was we enjoyed it. I'm glad that you, we did buy the tickets. I'm glad we finally got to go because it was it was a it just, man. Just the amount of work that they put into it, you could tell that the people that throw this, they spend a lot of time yeah. on on this, you know. So it's a little yeah. I recommend it to anybody who gets a chance to go check it out. Dude. I'm definitely gonna do that, and you guys too. And if you do, let us know in the comments how you liked it, or if you have been to it, let us know in the comments what you think of it. And also, you know, let us know in the comments what you think of the trailer too. And then, you know, are you a Stranger Things fan? And if you are, we'd like to hear from you. And of course, above all guys, don't forget to subscribe to the yeah. Narcocast guys and make sure that you guys are checking out all the Malcontents music, man. I mean, yes. it's, always, it's always good for you guys to support local music. And these guys are hitting it and they're hitting it hard. They're writing new music. They're going to be doing shows soon. I mean, come on. Come on. What's not to love? Show soon. What's not soon. to love? <laughs> we're, we're, we're putting the set together right now because we want to make it different, man. That's been our whole thing since we started writing and started getting, you know, like got back together as we wanted to make our um, our stranger experience, thing experience better, you know, like. Hell yeah. So the next time you see us play, we hope that it's not – the same experience that you know that it's that, even that's what we're working on dude. that is what we're working on man <laughs> well well i think that's gonna do it for today's malco cast man thank you guys for joining us and make sure that you guys again subscribe to the channel leave a comment and leave a like and let us know let us know what you guys think of this new trailer and of the stranger things experience anthony I want to thank you for sharing I want to thank your family for sharing with us a big Word. shout out big shout out to them and we will catch you next time next time on the malco cast peace peace